everybody's really happy to be back and happy to support our troops. The main troop greeters are finally back where they belong, inside the Bangor International Airport, greeting the service men and women who pass through BIA, either returning home or heading out for a deployment. It's an act of service the all-volunteer group has been participating in since 2003. However, COVID put a stop to that in 2019. My family, being a teacher and doing this, those are three most important things that have been involved in my life. I can't think of it any more important than that. The 232 members of the main troop greeters were recently given the clearance they needed to resume their mission at BIA. And to have troop greeters back here doing what they do um, is just really special. We know that it's not going to be as busy as it was, but anybody who watches the national news knows that there is still troop activity overseas right now. And so the chances that we're going to have some flights coming through at some point over the next several months uh, are pretty good. Since 2003, the greeters have welcomed home more than 7,900 troop flights. Their dedication to our country's military was captured in a documentary called The Way We Get By. The film was created by Old Town native Aaron Gaudette, whose grandmother was a troop greeter. I think the movie just shows um, the power of a handshake, the power of a hug, just having some kindness. Um, given to you when you go through that airport. So I, I'm very pleased to hear that they're back. Back at BIA and ready to share even more gratitude and support for our men and women in uniform. In Bangor, I'm Jody Hersey for ABC7 and Fox 22.